براہ راست آپ کو لے چلتے ہیں وزیر خارجہ بلاول بھٹو عالمی ڈونرز کانفرنس سے خطاب کر رہے ہیں A hundred kilometer lake formed in the middle of our country. One in seven Pakistanis were affected by this natural disaster. That's 33 million people. Of the, of the 33 million people, 16 million were children, 600,000 pregnant women. And five months on, many areas of Pakistan are still underwater. We are still conducting our relief operations and we are looking forward to our reconstruction and rehabilitation. Uh, we welcome you all here, the, this unique conference for a resilient Pakistan, where the international community has come together in solidarity to stand beside a country that faced an epic natural disaster. Pakistan once again expresses its gratitude to the community of nations for the emergency assistance extended to our people. We highly appreciate the United Nations General Assembly's call for the convening of this conference. The magnitude of the damage Pakistan has suffered is monumental. While we remain steadfast in responding to the emergency needs of the affected population and the urgency of restoring their lives and livelihoods, we are according high priority to the resilient recovery and reconstruction of the affected infrastructure. The government of Pakistan has worked with, the interna with international institutions, including the United Nations, the World Bank, the Asian Development Bank, the European Union, to prepare a comprehensive framework document on resilient recovery, rehabilitation, and reconstruction. The 4RF document, which outlines a prioritized and sequential plan, is monumental. While we remain steadfast in responding to the emergency needs of the affected population and the urgency of restoring their lives and livelihoods, we are clearly Pakistan confronts a monumental challenge. The people and the government will, of course, do everything possible to help ourselves in the process of rebuilding and recovery from this colossal calamity. At least half of the framework plan will be implemented from our own resources. At the level of our local communities, we are already engaged in rebuilding and restoration of homes, villages, roads, and communication networks. Yet Pakistan will need considerable support over the next several years from our international partners to implement this comprehensive plan. We will transform the challenge of recovery and reconstruction into an opportunity to build a more resilient Pakistan, an economy which is dynamic and sustainable. We are determined to do it in an open, transparent, and collaborative way. Excellencies, the rationale for this conference is to demonstrate the international solidarity with Pakistan as it begins its journey towards building back better. We see this conference not as a one-off event, but as the commencement of a long-term partnership with our friends and development partners. We look forward to the generous and sustained commitment of support from you all. I thank you. Thank you, Excellency. جنیوہ میں سلاب زدگان کے لیے عالمی ڈونرز کانفرنس سے وزیر خارجہ پاکستان بلاول بھٹو زرداری خطاب کر رہے تھے انہوں نے پاکستان میں سلاب کی صورتحال کو دنیا کے سامنے رکھا اور بتایا کہ کس طرح سے پاکستان کی بیشتر آبادی ابھی بھی سلابی پانی میں ڈوبی ہوئی ہے انہوں نے یہ بھی بتایا کہ سلاب سے ہر ساتھ میں سے ایک پاکستانی متاثر ہے سلاب سے تین کروڑ تیس لاکھ افراد متاثر ہوئے سلاب سے بہت بڑے پیمانے پر تباہی ہوئی پاکستان میں لوگوں کے گھر روزگار کاروبار تباہ ہوئے سلابی پانی میں ڈوب گئے وزیر خارجہ بلاول بھٹو نے دنیا کے سامنے پاکستان کو پیش آنے والی موسمیاتی تبدیلیوں کے چیلنجز سے بھی آگاہ کیا اور یہ بھی بتایا کہ پاکستان متاثرہ ممالک میں سے ایک ہے جہاں بڑے پیمانے پر تباہی ہوئی ہے